Today we're going to look through These Delicious Things, which is an unusual cookbook in that it's by multiple authors. Memories and Recipes in Support of Magic Breakfast, which is an organization that helps fight hunger in British classrooms. So there's a whole bunch of British food celebrities and important people in the British food scene that contributed to this. Raymond Blanc, Angela Hartnett, Jamie Oliver, Andy Oliver, Asma Khan, Nigella Lawson, Stanley Tucci, Melissa Thompson, Yotam Odalengi, and more. So let's take a look. This came out in 2024, early on, at least here in the U.S. Pavilion is the publisher. Jane Hudson with Lucas Hallwig and Clerkenwell Boy. Photography by Tara Fisher and Patricia Niven, who did a stunning job. The table of contents is Good Mornings. Nibbly Bits, Little Lunches, Big Suppers, Sweet Things, Grown-Up Drinks, and then the acknowledgments, of course. The introduction, as with many a good idea, the concept for this book was sparked during a conversation over steaming plates of food, hunkered down on a winter's night around a kitchen table. And she wrote that the recipes, she wants to tell the story of why, not just how to cook the item. Magic Breakfast, Ending Hunger in the Classroom, with a QR code that you could scan. Good mornings, and I'll try to provide a link to Magic uh, Breakfast down below in the description. So the first thing we have is by Fiona Beckett. It's a marmalade recipe. Makes about eight, 4,000 jars, whatever that means. I guess 4,000 gram jars? I don't know. Uh, the next recipe is huevos rotos by Nieves Barragon Mochado, Mojacho, excuse me, Fungal Ferguson, dry cured bacon. So I haven't cooked or baked anything out of this cookbook. I haven't even looked through it yet. So if I'm stumbling on some of the names, please forgive me. We got a huge stack of cookbooks from the library and I'm so excited to show them to you that I didn't have time to preview. This is Jamie Oliver's proper porridge. Over here is some other ideas for serving porridge. Serves three. This is Nathan Outlaw's Smoked Haddock and Potato Pancakes. Ooh, gorgeous. I'm going to skip ahead a little bit. Jane Hodson's Soft Boiled Eggs with Buttery Cumin Soldiers. Clerkenwell Boy's Cheese and Marmite Babka. Let's skip ahead a little bit. Nibbly Bits, the second chapter. Richard Corrigan's Soda Bread. And I happen to be recording this video just before St. Patrick's Day when Americans want to be baking soda bread. Here is Kate Trelawney's Nam Jim. I have no idea what that is. Mitch Tonk's Shrimps on Toast. Now we're in the Little Lunches chapter with Rosie Ramsden's Crab Toasted Sandwiches. A beautiful spread in the middle. Mush oh, soused mackerel from Mark Hicks. Runner beans with garlic and tomato. Oh, I can't wait for summer. And this is by Henrietta Lovell, or Lavelle. Ooh, pretty. Here is Cheesy Leeks from Ed Smith. Nice comfort food casserole there. Ruth Rogers has corn polenta. This is Tom Carriage's Fish Finger Butties. Big Suppers is the next chapter we're going to peek inside. This is Comforting Rice with Chinese Sausage. Here's My Mother's Praise Chicken by Nigella Lawson. And here is Spaghetti Carbonara by William Sitwell. And Spiced Mutton Stew by Naved Nasir. Another comfort food winter autumn favorite. Here's Hopple Popple by Yotam Odolenki. The name made me giggle. There's some more beautiful photography in the middle. Here is Andy Oliver's Honey Baked Chicken Wings and Sweet Corn Pudding. Great combo. 
Ooh, I see some bread and some pasta, two of my favorite things. Here is Neapolitan ragu from Tom Parker Bowls. And this is Chicken Stock by Xanthi Clay, and I think I just mispronounced that majorly. I didn't have time to prep for this book, sorry. Sweet Things will be the final things we look through in this book. Churros by Jose Pizarro. Spiced Exotic Fruit by Lisa Markwell. Rice Pudding by Simon Hopkinson. Anna Del Conte's Lemon Granita. Yum. This is stunning. I love that everyone came together to do a benefit cookbook for Magic Breakfast. I'll drop a link to donate to Magic Breakfast below in the YouTube description. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next cookbook video.